ladies and gents hello and welcome to crypto space so guys in today's video we are going to cover bread at recent price action and on the top of that we are going to cover a couple of interesting charts for altcoins and btc that is quite a bit that i've got for you today ladies and gents if you are new to the channel please consider subscribing and a quick disclaimer that this video is not financial advice and now guys let's hop into bread itself so first things first that is a two hourly time frame and and now i have got into my bread position you know a while ago so i'm already up on my position and now obviously guys we are going to look you know at possible entries over here on the channel and possible you know price predictions of what i see could happen in a short term future and of course i'm going to also let you know what i think personally what is going to happen to bread in let's say six months one year from now on so what we are dealing with on a two hourly time frame with bread at the moment right so we do see that we have that you know huge pump right and then we had the huge dump pretty much right because that run you know is pretty much ongoing you know ever since 24th of may last month right so obviously we do have some cool off and sell off as well and now a bit of a disclaimer guys you do have have to make sure that you remember that bread is still a meme coin right and you know meme coins are pretty much you know very familiar with these type of dumps right pumps and dumps right that's something that you guys do have to remember before actually jumping into meme coin nevertheless guys on a two hourly time frame bread looks like it's actually you know properly resetted and now it looks like it has much more fuel to go towards the upside um, now it doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to go right away nevertheless as you guys can see we technically could experience that you know bullish cross and you know proper reset towards the upside nevertheless that's only two hourly time frame so actually now let's have a look at four hourly so as of the time of recording this video looks like brett is going to do the bullish cross at the moment and we are going to see you know the next pump most likely on a bread right so that is kind of a bullish you know as bullish as it can go on a four hourly time frame and now if it comes to the daily time frame guys um we don't really have too much of data on a daily for bread because obviously bread is relatively new project on the market and as of right now on a daily time frame for stochastic rsi it looks like bread is pretty much dumping and the question is is it going to dump or we are going to experience you know continuation towards you know the upside pretty much right because obviously the momentum is quite huge for bread now looking at overall market obviously bread doesn't necessarily look great over here in these bubbles right especially given the fact that you know most of the bubbles even caspa is pumping 7.6 percent on a daily let's have a look at the holders for a bread so so we do have 297,000. 949 holders for a bread guys so that accumulation as you guys can see over here that pump in terms of holders and overall accumulation is huge for bread and i do believe that this is just a beginning and now looking at bread and its market cap so we do have market cap at 940 million usd well almost 1 billion so how high this thing can go this cycle in my opinion well i do believe that 50x could be pretty much reasonable right given the fact that it's on base and obviously base once they're going to implement their smart wallets or however they call it and much more people are going to actually come into crypto through coinbase i believe that's going to pump our bags you know considering the fact that you're inbred right now and now actually let's have a look at shiba inu to actually compare it right and why shiba inu because i do believe that you know pepe is dogecoin of this cycle bread could be shiba inu of this cycle if that makes sense too so let's have a look at market cap of a shiba inu on the max we we've peaked around 41 billion right for a shiba inu so let's say that bread is going to do you know 40x i do believe that 40x will be quite you know significant amount of gains for many people and that will actually you know change many people's lives right of course i'm not saying you know jump into bread you know all in right we all should have like separate portfolio i believe for meme coins and separate portfolio for you know actual projects with utility but now guys you know let's actually have a look at a couple of charts and of course some news because that i believe is important so now we've got australia's first spot bitcoin etf is going to go live tomorrow as you guys can see much more countries are actually jumping into 
you know these etfs and they are approving them and obviously they are going to be traded or trading already like with us for instance which obviously means that potentially more money is going to flow into into bitcoin and what comes with that obviously other you know projects other layer ones are going to benefit from that you know such as ethereum such as base etc and of course little projects that are built on these networks well in this case i do believe that's going to benefit you know meme coins like bread and now shout out to El crypto prop that is a total market cap excluding bitcoin on a two weekly chart so old coins much higher targets in 2024 everything looks the same as in 2014 2018 it just takes longer and blue line is holding the most exciting part is yet to come so guys let's have a look at 2014 2018 right so before that mid cycle correction we have experienced you know obviously before that double bottom right that was our bear cycle and then we had the impulse wave number one mid cycle correction and then we had some boring price action for altcoins and nevertheless after that we have experienced the impulse wave number two so now guys obviously we do have the double bottom which is our bear cycle impulse wave one then mid cycle correction and impulse wave two so i do believe that you know sooner or later we are going to see that huge impulse wave two for altcoins and now shout out to the scalping pro so he is saying that we are basically exiting that we are here type of an area that we have already experienced in a previous cycle so as you guys can see we are pretty much leaving now and going towards the upside and the targets for this cycle for altcoins is 4 trillion usd that will be beautiful and now shout out to titan of crypto bitcoin bullish monthly candle close as i told you the month following the halving has always been a bullish month for btc and yes this cycle is no different exciting months ahead so guys this actually is a very bullish and i do know that bitcoin is boring at the moment however as titan of crypto said that monthly candle closed above that line which was our resistance and now it became our new support so that is very bullish and now shout out to trader Taringrade. bitcoin coincidence or price action bull flag and macd bullish cross at the same time after a breakout to the bull flag, BTC will surge higher. So guys, let's have a look what is going on. That is a three daily chart for BTC. And as you guys can see, we do have this bull flag that has already happened before. And at the moment we've got, you know, this bull flag. So I do believe that this target is going to play out just like it played out before. Now let's have a look at this chart. So that is a monthly chart for Ethereum. So 10,000 to 12,000 Ethereum is programmed. Ethereum's time to shine has come. So guys, why am I showing you Ethereum? Of course, we do know that, you know, we shouldn't be all in bread, as I just mentioned before. And if you are in some altcoins that are built on Ethereum, I do believe that these are basically the last chances to purchase any altcoins that you've been watching or you're interested that are built on Ethereum. Because once Ethereum is going to experience its, its cycle and is going to see its, you know, top, then we could expect projects being built on ethereum pumping like crazy and now guys shout out to mickey bull crypto so that is a daily chart for btc he's saying that bitcoin megaphone pattern has a price target of 85k and breakout is going to be soon so obviously that is our model over here and the target is 85k for btc with the next leg up and i do believe that this is possible guys and now according to the scalping pro bitcoin is forming a massive inverse head and shoulders pattern so guys that is going to be very interesting because target over here is 90k and now as you guys can see so far all of the charts are pointing to that 100k level for btc but let's see what's going to happen and now altcoins according to the scalping pro altcoin the final chop before it goes vertical so guys we are still in that chop now and this is what we have experienced you know after that chop in a previous cycle so as you guys can see if the history is going to repeat and rhyme we are going to see parabola for all coins in short term future and now shout out to El crypto prof and that is a total crypto market cap on the monthly chart which means that it's including everything old coins and btc looks like we are in for the most exciting months of the cycle so far the total market cap has copied the structure of 2020 almost perfectly parabola next i wouldn't mind and neither would you would you so guys let's have a look right that is a monthly chart so basically once we broke above that descending trend line 
aka burst cycle then obviously we had the first pump then you know the first sideways price action which is you know visible in that orange bubble nevertheless after that boredom we saw a huge parabola and now if we are going to look at this current cycle exactly the same thing is happening right we have exited you know that burst cycle aka descending trend line and then we had a little bit of pullback aka retest as well and then you know orange bubble in which we had the pullback and now it looks like we are ready to go and now that is ethereum bitcoin chart on a weekly guys all right if you think that altcoins have already seen most of their gains then you are wrong we haven't seen anything yet 2015 2018 just repeats in a larger time frame we are at the point just before the real fun begins so guys this is the chart that l crypto pro is actually updating every now and then and this is also the chart that i'm showing you ever since i started recording these videos so let's have a look at 2015 2018 obviously we do have our beautiful accumulation over here then the first pump reaccumulation, and then the short squeeze and the breakout and boom parabola right so now this current cycle from 2018 2024 exactly the same thing is happening so we do have our huge accumulation then the first pump then obviously reaccumulation, and then the short squeeze i believe is going to happen sooner or later and we are going to see huge parabola for old coins and on the top of that guys as you can see we do have that bullish divergence that has occurred not that long ago so something really big is coming in my opinion and now according to the scalping pro a parabola has been intact right we haven't dipped below that parabola which is very very bullish of course that doesn't mean that you know we are going to see a straight gold candle up to let's say 200k for btc but what it means is that we are going to have some stops on the way which are going to allow us to reaccumulate and take profits right so we do have to remember about that nevertheless this is very bullish because we still have some time to go in that parabola for btc and now guys plan b this is one of the biggest ogs on twitter and also on youtube so shout out and according to him bitcoin bull market continues like clockwork guys that's it what i've got for you today i hope that you have guys enjoyed that you know first bread update and overall market update on this channel and i wish you having a great day peace and love crypto